Business to music finance. Is he trying to win? During one of our conversations, you talked about how some comedians will have a joke that they start in January and they won't perfect it or they'll they'll keep doing it up yeah. until like something like May or June, right? Five, six months. Even longer. You know, why why is that? You might have a you might have an idea about a, a joke. So the first thing you're gonna do is probably either write it down or put it on stage, but it's very raw. You know what I'm saying? It's not like, the game is to kind of paint pictures with words. That's kind of the game. Take people's minds and but and do that in the most efficient and funny way at the same time. So the, the first raw idea, the way it plays out is funny, but now you have to translate it into words, translate the actions, make sure your actions on stage match the words. Um, you got to find the beats of the of the joke. You got to find out, you know, when to emphasize this, when to emphasize that. Uh, what words are not necessary for the joke? Because you're gonna write it, and you you might have a whole page on that one joke, and then by the end of the joke, it's like three quarters of a page, or half a page, or less a quarter of a page. You've reduced it. You've reduced it because you took out all the things that didn't matter f- for the for the joke. You know what I'm saying? For the, to get to the funny part, to get to the funny. So what happens is you start with a raw idea. You write it, you put it on stage, you fill it out, you start talking, you use the words, and then you're like, okay, I don't need that. That didn't that didn't flow. You know what I'm saying? Um, if you, if you want to think about Jay Z, it's like you you thinking about the beat, you thinking about the joke, and then you got to figure out how to in your mind how to make the words as seamless as possible to get to the funny. And so that's what happens with the joke. And then it becomes like a plant where it's like this joke leads into another joke. So now how do we, f- how do we fit this into the existing jokes that we got? Um, what else can we add to the scenario, that I, the picture I painted in your head to make the joke funnier? How do I make it more, how do I give it more gravitas? How do I, how do I engage you more so that you're just linked into the joke? And I can say, I can paint this whole world, you know, and you're following it like seamlessly, like, you, you get it, A, B, C, D. But it takes a while to paint that picture and to paint it thoroughly and effectively. So it's like you start with a raw idea and then you got to get on stage. You got to keep talking, talk to different audiences, talk to different people. How do they feel about it? How do they react? When do people react automatically? If I say this word, I get the laugh every time. Okay, that's you know like a checkpoint or a, a landmark. What can I do before that to get another laugh? You know, make another landmark. Now I got two landmarks. And then what can I do after that? Uh, can I add a voice to this person that's the other person that's in the joke? You know what I mean? Like this, yeah. there's different. Uh, building the joke. You're building it out. You're building it out, filling out the world, putting details in there that mean something to the joke and that you can also use for another joke. But that that kind of thing takes, you know, like I say, it's like a plant. The, the initial idea is the seed. It starts to grow as you start talking about it. You, you water it. You think about it. Um, another branch pops off. Oh, I can take it this way. Boom. You keep watering that. You start doing that often. Oh, shit. I can take it this way. Another another branch, another leaf. And it just keeps blossoming like that. And so that takes time. And, takes time. And, and I get I get why you say now that it could take, you know, half a year to, to perfect a joke. Because yeah. once it's funny, it's going to hit every time. Most of the time, that's. The, I mean, maybe not every time in every room, but it, you you can rely on it. You know what I'm saying? Like you can put it in the say it's reliable. And mm-hmm. uh, you know, a lot of people see Netflix specials or specials, and they think, oh, they just talk like that. You know, for a while when I first started, I was like, oh, he's just he's just uh, man, he's real smooth. He you know he talks like that. He's just being natural himself. But being natural takes work, which is crazy to think about. But to make it seem natural takes a lot of work. You know, think about like a magician. It's like the sleight of hand looks effortless, but it took him how many times did he practice that trick before it seemed effortless? You know what I mean? That's kind of comedy. How many times did they tell that joke before it just rolls off the tongue like conversation? That's why it takes a while to to get into the flow of a set and to make a whole set, to make a bit, to make, you know, get your routine down. Hey, what's up? It's your boy Wham. You're tuning in to Business Music Finance, the show that gives you the game you need to know. I need you to tap in right now. Hit that subscribe button if you like what you see. And if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, you can hit me here or on IG. Until then, stay out of trouble. And remember, it's cool to be smart.